What's up guys, we are going to do a different video for you today, Cosmet style, we are going to do a Super Bowl recap, let's get right into this thing. Super Bowl didn't disappoint me this year, Super Bowl 55. Super Bowl 55 kind of started off a little slow, with both teams getting one first down in their first two possessions. Then Kansas City, the Kansas City first scores with a 49 yard field goal from Harrison Buckner. Yeah, I mean, they started off slow, and I figured they got points on the board first. I feel like they were off to the race. I was kind of shaking. I was like, oh, boy, what's going to happen here? But eh, they kind of they kind of showed their worth at the first beginning, first few minutes of this game. We then have Tom Brady and Rob Gronkowski connect for the first touchdown of the game. Of course, these two former Pats players had to get the first touchdown of the game, actually breaking the record for most postseason touchdowns with 13. These Pretty two, incredible. These, it's crazy how two guys can just carry carry a team into the Super Bowl and win the Super Bowl. But nonetheless, Kansas City's biggest problem of the first half was just the mistakes on the field, which is numerous penalties and on the first half, and just Tampa's offense just to stay on the field. The biggest was a pass interference called on Kansas City's quarterback, uh, Rashad Breland. Yeah, Rashad Breland. I mean, on Mike Evans, it allowed them to get right down the field on the 10-yard line and it allowed uh, Antonio Brown to catch a touchdown Yikes for the right, first as half. The, right as the first half ended. Yeah, that late touchdown to end the half definitely made Kansas City's defense very frustrated, making the score 21-6 to to end the first half. With all the penalties in Kansas City's offensive line not being able to hold up in Kansas City, superstars just... Two biggest weapons, Travis Kelce and Tyree Hill, being pretty much healed in check and Patrick Mahomes not getting there in time to throw that football. They were lucky to only be down by 15 just going into the first half, which I thought could have been much worse. Tom Brady, the only quarterback in Super Bowl history to complete 80% of his passes in the first half and have three touchdowns. 16 for 20. That is absolutely nuts with Kansas City's offensive line only being able to just muster up those 124 yards. Just a total offense in the first half. Then Tampa Bay's defensive pressure and coverage certainly disrupted Kansas City in the first half, which I was happy to see because I want the Buccaneers big time. We open the second half then with a 26-yard run from Clyde edwards away. <sighs> yeah, and then a 9-yard catch from Travis Kelce. Just looking to get some, some big momentum, which he certainly did. I certainly thought they were gaining some momentum here. Unfortunately, it stalled out, and they had to settle for another long field goal, a 50-yard field goal made by Harrison Bucker, making the score 21-9. to I would say Tampa Bay's two biggest weapons of the night were certainly Rob Gronkowski with six catches for 67 and two touchdowns, and Antonio Brown, someone that really turned his life around, getting five catches for 21 yards and a touchdown. I can just say that's absolutely nuts, but Tampa Bay's defense just, they do continue to play, to play strong on a third and 14, causing an interception by the superstar Patrick Mahomes. I think we were all thinking with the game coming down to the wire here, if Tampa Bay scored another touchdown, we pretty much thought the game was going to be over. All they could muster up here was a 52-yard field goal by Ryan Suckup making the score 31 to nine. But just with 15 minutes left to play, we then had Kansas City making their way down the field, just trying to score that second, uh, or se not their second, their very first touchdown of the game, which I, they couldn't, they couldn't do much this game, Kyle. Yeah, I didn't see that coming. Patrick Mahomes, the first game in his career, not being able to throw a touchdown, and only one for eight, on third downs in the game. I think, that, I, I think that pressure facing against those two all-time greats and you upcom you an upcoming rookie, I think that certainly had some gain on him, huh? Yeah, for sure. With some other amazing stats in the game, Patrick Mahomes, first game in his career to not have a touchdown through the first three quarters of the game. Yeah, oh, oh boy, I was I was hoping for, for something big from Patrick uh, last night, but we didn't it. never get it. really happened, yeah. Yeah, Patrick Mahomes was absolutely running for his life on a fourth down. Throwing the ball to the end zone from his knees, unfortunately his wide receiver was not able to catch it, forcing a turnover on downs, Tampa takes over again. Yeah, with just the just a great balance in the running and passing uh, game, just dominating the final stretches of this Super Bowl 55. Yeah, Ronald Jones and Leonard Fournette both having over 60 yards rushing. It's pretty incredible to see two running backs on the same team have over 60 yards. The new upcoming star, Patrick Mahomes, absolutely takes a beating and a mauling this game, being knocked down or sacked just eight more times. The Super Bowl, I mean, it never disappoints with some funny action going on with just five minutes and 30 seconds left in the game. We had a fan streaking on the field and then just start running across the field. What is this, uh, 
but, WWE segment oh, we got man. going on here. Oh man. But just, just the causing... security guards definitely suplexed him. <laughs> this this not just, any part of it. This caused the refs to call a stoppage on the game, of course. Um, on a fourth and ten, Kansas City just turns the ball over, just pretty much putting a kibosh to to any Super comeback Bowl. chance they had, yeah. yeah. Yeah, pretty much to sum up the game, the game ended with a 31-9 score. I'm pretty sure we both didn't see that coming. Tom Brady winning a seventh Super Bowl, most by any player and most, more than any other team has won a Super Bowl. Just think about that. Yeah. That's pretty incredible. Most time with, what, seven Super Bowl wins under his belt, Tom Brady, the all-time GOAT. You know, I think we can put to rest who is better, Bill Belichick or as a coach or as Tom Brady as a player. Tom Brady also be named at the Super Bowl MVP and Tampa Bay just, just being the first team to win, win the, the Super, Super Bowl, Bowl in yeah. their home stadium. This this isn't happening in so long, Kyle. At all, ever, yeah. All right, guys, that was it for Cosmet's recap of the Super Bowl. Certainly not what we both expected, but I mean, I guess Tom Brady's the GOAT. What, do you got, what else you got to say? All right, guys, we will be doing a wrestling video for you guys tomorrow in the studio. So like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.